Good afternoon, everybody. And this is Don, aka the Interactive Nanny, coming to you again today from Interactive Nanny's World. I'm so glad to be coming to you guys this week. I'm so ready and so excited for our topic today. We are going to be talking about inclusion in children. Inclusion for like special need children or for different children that may have different learning disabilities or other disabilities. It is important that now in today's world, in today's classrooms or whatnot, that we include them and not set them off in different classes or um, sort of just not give them the opportunity to try to learn alongside of their peer, their, um, I guess, average peers or whatnot. So that's what we're going to be um, talking about today, just inclusion, and we're going to sort of define what is inclusion, how can we um, incorporate inclusion into our classroom, and other just little tidbits that we're um, going to get into. Inclusion in children. One of the most important topics when working with children in today's world is the topic of inclusion. My focus is to begin a very important discussion on inclusion. What it is, what is the purpose, is inclusion important? Can it make the atmosphere better in in class or, or working with children in general? So, what is inclusion? It's the action or state of including or of being included within a group or structure. What is the concept? Inclusion is an educational practice whereby students with with special needs are fully integrated into the general education classes. What's the general idea? The term inclusion captures and it it, it in, inclusion in captures in captures and uh, the act of embracing society societal ideology. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm getting sort of mixed up here. Regarding individuals with disabilities and special and special education needs, inclusion sh- little inclusion. I'm <laughs> secures opportunities for students with disabilities to learn alongside their non-disabled peers in general and in, in general in cl- education classes Ugh. so yes inclusion is important it does make a big difference in our schools and with our children not only does it help our children with disabilities and special needs to adjust to being in general education classes with non-disabled peers it also opens the eyes of our non-disabled children. Inclusion exposes them to other children with different differences and um, disabilities. It allows them to help them to help the other students learn f- with them, and it also allows the non-disability students to to learn and 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 explore the children with disabilities so that they can help them get better and help things move a little more smoothly for them. It teaches them that not everybody is alike and that it's okay to have differences. Inclusion helps teachers as well. Teachers can get their peer groups together and then are able to observe different scenarios with the different peer groups. Different lessons will have to be adjusted or expanded but a different way of learning can take place. Inclusion also opens up everyone's hearts and eyes. We all have or know someone with special needs or disabilities. It teaches acceptance. We, we all should practice inclusion, not just in schools and in classrooms, but in our everyday lives. So if you have any questions or comments about inclusion, or if you just have some ideas on how we can um, incorporate the idea of inclusion more into our everyday lives. You can leave me a message here on Interactive Nanny's World. You can email me at interactivenanny at gmail.com. Um, yeah. But that was just, you know, my little tidbit on inclusion in children for today. Again, this is Don 
signing off from Interactive Nanny's World. This is the Interactive Nanny where love and play are interactive. Thanks. I'll see you guys next week. Next week, as a matter of fact, we'll actually have a special guest for our first interview here on Interactive Nanny's World. So get ready, and I will see you guys next week. Thanks again. This is Don, a.k.a. the Interactive Nanny, signing off. Inactive Nanny's World where love and play are interactive. Thanks. Bye-bye.